So this is definitely what I like to see. I want to give a huge shout out to all of the supporters. I want to give a huge shout out to all of the returning supporters. If you are new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. We going up every single day, man, one day at a time. Appreciate everybody. Yes, sir. It's your boy TC Talks. TC Fitness. Hold long. Hey. And I am here. Back at it again. I'm here, man. With another video. Now. First thing first, bruh. Before I even start this video off, of course, I gotta give a huge shout out to all the new supporters on the channel. I gotta give a huge shout out to all of the Turner supporters as well. I wanna say thank you for hitting that subscribe button. Thank you, bruh. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody retaining their life force energy, staying focused on their no fab journey. If y'all gained something from this video, hit the like button. Please make sure you subscribe to the channel if you are new to the channel. And make sure to leave your comments below, bro. Now, in today's video, for those of y'all that already know, man, Semen retention and no fat grind don't stop. I'm here to talk about some of my favorite personal benefits. This is just me or from my experience. You know what I'm saying? I'm here to share it with y'all in today's video. And um, I just want to let you guys know right now that when you want semen retention, when you want no fat, this is your journey to bring yourself back to life. And why do I say that? Like I told you in my previous video, bro. When you watching these sites and when you giving your energy away, you are slowly like becoming a zombie, bro. Let's just keep it real, bro. You, you're not being as aware as you are supposed to be in this reality of life, you know? And I'm gonna keep it real, bro. Like breaking free from the addiction of watching other people, you know, fornicate on the screen and breaking free of, you know, self-destruction. Cause that's basically what Masturbate, masturbating is, bro, self-destruction. When you break free from that, bro, you feel 10 times better. I was about to say 30 times better, bro. You really feel a thousand times better. You feel me? Internally. And that's what it's about, bro. You gotta, sometimes, bro, like, you have to, like I said, bring yourself back to life, bro. You don't want to be feeling like a zombie, bro, 24-7. That's trash. Now, just had to share that with y'all. Um, the first thing we're going to talk about is the willpower the willpower in the drive bruh i have a tremendous amount of drive to conquer what it is that i want to conquer in my reality my personal goals you know and being on semen retention being on no fat has helped me with shifting the mentality from weak to positive you feel me from weak to strong or from scarcity to abundant you know what I'm saying? And that requires a lot of work that can't nobody in this world do for you but you. You know? Nobody is going to help you become abundant unless you believe that within yourself that you are truly abundant and worthy of it. A lot of people walking around feeling like they're not worthy of nothing. I tell myself every day I'm worthy of it. Why? Because I know how it feels to not have so why not know how it feels to actually have, right? And then be grateful. Always be grateful for what you already do have, bro. You feel me? You cannot not be grateful, bro. Like, that's not, that's not life, bro. You have to show gratitude. You got to be thankful. You feel me? But like I said, man, the willpower, I'm willing to do whatever it takes for me to accomplish my goals, you know? I'm not giving myself excuses. I'm not uh, overthinking, you feel me? I'm not telling myself we can't do this. No, bro. If you tell yourself you can't, and if you tell yourself you can, you are right. You feel me? So start telling yourself more positive things, you know? Another thing that I've noticed is that I've been a lot more patient with myself. You, you, you can't want instant gratification all day. You just, you just can't, you feel me? You gotta delay your gratification. You have to be, you know, patient with the process, bro. Because you gotta understand this, that you are breaking an addiction and habit that you was doing for years of your life, right? And it's slowly destroying your mental health. It's slowly destroying your spiritual growth. It's destroying your connection to your actual higher self. Everybody has a higher self, right? 
The higher self cares about you and your well-being and your best decisions. The lower self, that's the self that you need to learn from. Because the lower self helps you understand and understand who you don't want to be. You feel me? But you don't bash your lower self because you have to learn. It's a process. You understand what I'm saying? But you have to connect to the higher version of you. The better version of you. And it's only going to benefit you on a day-to-day -day basis. You know? I wrote this down. Self-evaluation. That's what you're doing on semen retention. You got to evaluate yourself. Evaluate your decision making. You know? Evaluate your habits, bro. What you doing on a day-to-day -day basis? Are you exercising? Are you journaling? Are you drinking your water? Are you getting you some sunlight? Are you staying focused on your purpose? Are you staying focused on your vision that you have for yourself? Or are you being blinded by outside things, by outside distractions? There's so many things that could distract us in this reality, right? But we got to stay focused. You got to always stay focused on the bigger picture, right? You know what I'm saying? That's what it's about. So you got to evaluate yourself. Study yourself. Love yourself. Master yourself, right? That's what it's about. Understand your old triggers. Things that may trigger you. You feel me? Like... There's certain things that may trigger a person to 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 want to go watch the sights again, right? But when you pay attention to that trigger, you then need to take action. Do something else. Do something way more productive. When you want semen retention, you should be productive. That's it. Grind, work, grind, work. Let me get my energy back because I owe it to myself. That's what you're supposed to be doing. You shouldn't be focused on the wrong things, bruh. You got to be focused on the right things. You feel me? What else? What else I wrote down, man? I told y'all this in a previous video. Nobody can save you but you. No matter how many semen retention videos you watch. No matter how many no fat videos you watch. You can get the motivation. You can get inspired. Yes, but you got to be able to save yourself, bruh. You have to. You have to. And it's going to feel good. You feel me? Keep vibing with yourself. Understand the importance of your life force energy, bro. It don't matter what day you are on, bro. You got to make every day count. You have to make every day count. Semen retention, no fat, is a lifestyle, bro. This is, this is your life. This is your life. This is not no temporary trial, bro. This is your life. Change your perspective. You feel me? Perspective is everything. Perspective is everything. And once you build that, that awareness, because that's one of the words that I wrote down right here, bruh. You have to heighten that on this, on this journey, bruh. Be aware. Be aware. Be aware. Only I can save me. Only the Most High God can uh, can guide me and save me. You feel me? Only the Most High God can continue to mold me and show me what I need to see. Cause sometimes we blinded to a lot of stuff, bro. But we gotta, you gotta be able to see, bro. You gotta see. God wants you to have your life force energy. If you're not gonna procreate, if you're not gonna bring a child into this world, then allow that energy to create a new you. Sexual energy is the highest form of energy we hold as human beings in this world. Literally, the highest. But yet, all you was taught to do was what? Waste it. Waste it. Every single day, you're used to ejaculating. You're used to not having no energy, bro. Every single day, that is your default. But when do you get tired of being tired? When do you break out of that mentality? That's why you have to save yourself and do the work. Everything starts internally. You feel me? And then it's going to show externally in the outside world, bruh. You know what I'm saying? If you change internally, if you do the work internally, if you tell yourself, nah, I got, I got us, bruh. I got us. I know what's more important. My time, my energy. You know what I'm saying? Strengthening my spirit. Getting my mental health at a thousand percent having mental clarity getting my connection with the most high god on a sensational level i know what's important bruh 
being the best version for me so that I can be the best me to this world, bruh. Like, it's bigger than you. You have an impact on people that you might not even know. It's so real, bro. Like, if you speak life into somebody, you don't know how that will change somebody's mentality. You just don't know unless you try. The same exact way you can say something negative to a person or they can say something negative to you and then it, impact, it impacts you. It's the same exact thing. We all have an impact on each other's lives, bro. We just, you just gotta see that. You speak life into yourself, you will speak it into others. You want good for yourself, you will want good for others. The same way you done broke yourself from the addiction, help other people, bro. These videos are helping people. And that's why I make them. Because they don't want people to really know how powerful they really, really, truly are, bro. But you are powerful. I'm not going to tell you anything different. Do the inner work. Do the shadow work. Do the self-evaluation. Believe in yourself. Trust in yourself. Trust in the most high God. That God will help you. They can't have your energy forever, bruh. One day in life, you're going to have to eventually take your energy back and just keep it to yourself and heal yourself. One day in life, you're going to eventually be tired of it, bro. You're going to be tired of putting yourself through it. But until that day comes, you got to keep, got to keep mastering yourself, bro. You have to. These sites will never serve you. It won't. The best feeling in the, in the world is to have that self-control, that self-love. The best feeling in the, in the world is to know that I have life force energy in me. That's going to push me through life every single day. And it's helping me out. It's the best feeling in the world, right? But only you can take your power back. Strictly up to you. Strictly up to you. If you gained something from this video, please make sure to hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you are new to the channel. Welcome to the channel once again. Um, leave your comments below. Let me know what y'all thought about this video. Please let me know some of your favorite benefits, being on semen retention, being on OFAP. How has it affected your life in a positive way? How are you working on bringing yourself back to life? You got to re, re... How do you say it? Resuscitate, right? Bring yourself back, right? I don't want to be zombie land 24 7 because of the because of the industry no bro get your energy back you owe it to yourself bro hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you are new to the channel like i said leave your comments below it's your boy tc talks